more forms of communication as well. We thank you for this. We also wish to express that we request to understand the amount of queries that remain. We have three questions left and the drawing. Yes, let us take the three queries in a quicker fashion and continue to your drawing as well. Okay. Um, our next question is for you from Chad, who says, question is for Ardiff. You have my permission to read my entire energy spectrum. I'm wondering what blocked chakras I may have and how to go about opening them to improve my energy flow. Love and light to you all. Yes, of course. In our own form, we have utilized the term blocked before, and we try to steer away from the verb to blocked, as blocked implies no flow. What there is in your chakras is in fact not blocking, but resistances. And most of the resistances within the construct of all self are average formed of human or much better. In those that are average in human nature, you go to your second and third chakra that are tied together for the co-creation. The flow of energy from the heart to the third and then to the second and then to the first, then to the release as part of your lower chakra energetic field of course, is not working correctly when there's a resistance in the third, and then the lack of energy that goes into the second during times of development in certain attributes of your second chakra then work with the first and third and experience even more resistances for that experience. So, in the way that it goes down, resistant, and less goes, and then goes out, there's also some that comes back into the heart chakra to finally be reabsorbed in the level of your second chakra. So it is a looping system, but not one of great consequence. If you desire to work on those energies, then start by working with the construct of releasing those parts of your self-experience in judgment coming towards yourself. This does not only help the heart does not only help the third chakra, but it will allow more energy to flow to the second chakra, which naturally starts forming a healing process there. Work within, again, yet the 10-step belief system process to work on multitudes of belief systems that you hold that can also add to the resistances here, but mostly, in its greatest importance, work with the heart chakra. Even though yours does not hold as high resistance levels as subhumans hold, it is the first place where energy collides from the root and from your own etherical grids. Once this occurs, the ignition process starts and redistributation from the center upwards and downwards simultaneously feeds the rest of your chop. So by de facto, the construct of your heart gaining access to more energy will, of course, keep the other chakras more energy as well. We thank you for this. All right, thank you. And I want to let you know that Chad has won the drawing, Chad OKC. I'm putting my email address up here, so please get me the questions uh, to expedite things. Uh, Maria says, for Trevor Ardiff, are there...